Yo, it is hot. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Roots and Recipes. I'm Mikhail Anthony, and I had the opportunity to catch up with a friend, Chef Ben Diaz. I filmed him at Court Fire Kitchen at Temecula Creek Golf Club. And while I was there, I got to meet his master gardener, Master Gardener Sema. And she gave me a brief tour of their chef's garden. And uh, I'm going to play it for you in a bit. And then we're going back and she's going to show me the farm at Temecula Creek Golf Club, which is a win-win for me because I like the golf and I like the farm. So, well, garden, right? So she's going to show me the farm, show off some cool stuff there. Uh, maybe I'll get nine or 18 would be better, but nine holes in would be even, that's fine with me. You know, might as well multitask. And I'm rambling. So here's the episode. It's a beautiful day called a peep to come out late. Tell me about the process of starting a garden. Okay, we grow in here everything uh, for organic gardening. We Everything is in sustainable. And we don't use any herbicide, pesticide, insecticide. None of those chemicals enters our garden. And what we use is we use like plants to get the, to fertilize the soil. And again, we use plants to fertilize the other plants because they are the companion plants. They benefit each other. So we choose wisely which plants goes together. Like for example, in here, you see the zinnias in here. They are actually great pollinators. We invite uh, butterflies, birds, uh, bees, and to this garden, they pollinate the, whatever we are growing. It could be in the summertime, tomatoes, peppers. It is in the wintertime, carrots and beets. So everything just mm. like, awesome. yes, they synchronize with each other. And we use in the farm. We have a small farm oh, in the awesome. you should yeah, see that number sometime. three. Yes, it's beautiful. Right now it's covered with tomatoes. Oh, cool. It's really nice. <laughs> okay, awesome. What else is in this chef's garden here? Uh, right now is the transition time. We are um, uh, getting ready to put uh, some, we do some renovations in here. We uh, enrich the soils and we do some uh, improvements in this garden. And then we're going to start for pole plantings. It could be carrot, peas and beets. But we have some one month transition, so we just check the irrigation and we take care of the garden right now. Yes. What's uh, Chef's favorite thing? Okay, he uses mostly herbs. We have nice herbs. I just harvested a couple of days ago in here. The thyme and oregano and basil. And they grow fantastic in here. These are all nice established herbs in that area. And these beds are where all carrots and we harvested these ones. And we also, another uh, bed is just, um, we are waiting right now because we harvested the uh, potatoes in that area, mm -hmm. potatoes and beans. So it's kind of a transition <laughs> right now. Awesome. Yes, Sweet. it will start growing in next month. Can again. I come back and see the farm sometime? Oh, well, that would be excellent. Yes, excellent. Even if you have time, I can quick show you around uh, too. May maybe later, but I'll maybe get your card information or I'll reach out to Chef and get your information. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> That's perfect. Yeah. Good. 